So in this video, I'm going to show you how to put your electronic parking brake F-150 in park, park maintenance mode so you can change the brakes. Also, at the same time, this applies for fusions, any kind of vehicle, generally from with Ford that has an electronic parking brake, it's done the same way. If there's any differences, you guys could, if it's not working for you, you can message me on this vehicle and I will, I will re-verify through the Ford system. Maybe there's something different, but typically that's not the case. It's done the exact same way across the board. So this is a Ford parking brake service mode, so you can change the brakes. Do not, under any circumstance, try to compress that piston in without doing it this way. I've had people call me up and say, oh crap, I just damaged my calipers and now they want $2,000 for a set of electronic parking brake calipers and all this other stuff and do the work. It's because you didn't do it correctly. You cannot, on an electronic parking brake system, just collapse it in and expect it to work perfectly fine afterwards without doing it this way. Okay, I'm going to show you how to put your electronic parking brake f-150 in service mode so you can do the brakes just like any other standard brake job the key is knowing how to do it and a lot of people don't know how to do it key off foot on the accelerator push it all the way down key on and while you're doing the key on you're going to hold the parking brake in at the same time Pushing it down right now, turning the key on, holding it down, 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 off, and then back on again. Holding it down, holding it down, holding it down, holding it down, holding it down. We are in parking brake service mode. Park brake maintenance mode. Now you can go ahead and turn your key off and it will stay in maintenance mode until you do the same thing but move the switch in the applied position. Quick tips.